Welcome to Mascara Fighters vlog. This is Alvarez paint sampler. So we're gonna be more or less assembling a figure of the Grande version of the Alvarez brothers. There's a one, you know, resin right there. But we're gonna, you know, start playing with paint basically today. And I've more or less started here with some of the legs, but it's also time to start working on some of the hands. Now these are not the final hands. Those are the final hands at the moment because I might need to add a little something to make it as best as possible. These are the hands or the arms, if you will, of the, the recreated uh, resin figures for the first wave of figures of Mascara Fighters. But since this is what we got, this is what we're running with basically. Bienvenidos a Máscara Fighters Vlog. Hoy estoy haciendo un sampler de pintura para las figuras de los hermanos Álvarez. Básicamente cómo empieza a verse con un poco de pintura. No, es un sampler y es una prueba, pero ahí le vamos avanzando. Estas manos de que pueden ver son las manos de la primera línea de juguetes. No es las manos finales, pero ahí se avanza. Y aquí estoy pintando la otra mano. Now I am painting the other hand. And while this dries, I'll be gluing that. So, trying to get it from as much angles and stuff as possible. Make it as appealing as possible too, because this is video format as well, you can see. There. Let's see here. Let me add a little more paint here. Right there. Now we get the paint out of the way. Let's see about assembling these legs. These legs are gonna need a lot of work. But that's part of the toy making process as well. Okay. So Let's see. And yeah, the feet are unbalanced as hell, so I have to jerry rig their balance. But like I said, toy making is is toy making. That is what it, exactly what it is. It's very toyish. So see if that'll more or less hold for a second while I start working on this piece here, which is the chest. Let's see if I can get these arms on there. This is being done in real time, so I'm literally waiting for the glue to dry. But I think that's also kind of the fun of it. You, you get to see it from inception to completion. Like I 
can see better now. What this is starting to look like. More or less. It's coming along. Let's see if the feet are dry enough to hold their weight. Yeah, that's unfortunate there. Toy making is also messy. <laughs> but got to do what you got to do to clean it up. So for this one, I am going to glue on the actual torso to the crotch area. So it doesn't move, it doesn't need to. This is a sampler figure, so this isn't for factory anyways. Let's see here if he'll hold. Obviously he has to, a little more glue on this side. But that's the idea of what the body's looking like right now. To maybe scrape off some of this glue, but this is the foot that's off on this one. to uh, what the figure looks like so far that's this is my only head I'm gonna glue this on just for for show here and we'll bring in the metal droid here the grande version to show exactly how it looks and now let me move camera so I can really get in there so here is where we are and here is where the figure stands I think it's really coming along but you know this is uh, this is where we are for today thanks for watching you know the actual assembly of this figure the painting the whole thing this has been a fun vlog, and for more, check out at Mascara Fighters on social media and mascarafighters.com.